Good afternoon, everybody. Jeremy Marquez here at J Marketing. We call you close more real estate listings. So guess what, guys? We're working on these new foreclosure leads. We already got the mailers about to drop today. Uh, so we're gonna, in this new campaign, we're rolling out the pre-foreclosures with the short sales, the whole bit, and it's a whole new thing for uh, for this agent and this, this team. However, what we're gonna do, like I said, we just dropped mail. Um, every day they come in. Right now we have about 160 leads, but you'll probably get anywhere from one to five new ones on a daily basis. So we're gonna track it from the very beginning. Yesterday I first cracked into it. Um, the whole idea is basically these people, a lot of them are at risk of losing their home. Some of them are gonna be able to negotiate with their banks and figure things out. A lot of them will not be able to, and as a result, will need to sell. Some of them already have a realtor, some of them don't. For the ones that don't, we're gonna be able to try to create a relationship with them and show them that we can help them get out of that house, avoid foreclosure, and then get into a new house that they, they can actually afford, even if that's renting for a while. Okay, so enough of the talking, let's do some walking. As always, there's links everywhere. You got links to the group, you got links to the services, you got links to whatever you want. If you could, give me a like, give me a follow, share this, invite people in. Uh, we're gonna do this from 12 to one. It's 11.57 right now. Hey Richard, just giving you a quick call from Coldwell Banker here in Petaluma. I had a quick question about your uh, property there on Decanter. Uh, when you get this message, if you can give me a call, call back. Again, this is Jeremy with the Tommy Quinn team. 707-285-7011. 707-285-7011. Sometimes we leave voicemails. Again, we're testing out this campaign, so we're trying different things to see how, what kind of results we can get. I think I'm going to, so right now I have the three line dialer on, I need to turn that off. I want to be able to have more control. It's not like we're doing circle prospecting or old expires where you just want to burn the room. Let's do the single line. Yes, I was calling for Richard or Tamara. Oh, you have the wrong number. Oh, I apologize. Uh, it's about 216 Decanter Circle. Do I just have bad information, sir? Uh, that's where they live. That's where I used to live. I see. So you, you know them. I just, you know, that's just not your property. Yeah. Okay, well, I'm with Coldwell Banker, just trying to add a quick question about the property. I have some other numbers, I'll reach them there. Okay, thank you. Have a good day. So, friend or family, 
It sounded like he had just run, ran to the phone. <laughs> Well, she did, they just hung right up. We're going to call them right back. <laughs> they hung right up again, and I don't think they want to talk. See, one of the um, one of the things you need to do that we need to do that I will be doing, and when you're calling these type of leads, is you need to be the specialist. You have to specialize. You specialize in helping homeowners like I, I specialize in helping homeowners like yourself get out of situations that they're in with without negative consequences to your credit and or otherwise. So basically what you're doing is you're aligning yourself as a specialist that, that specializes in helping homeowners avoid foreclosure. I'm not just calling you out of the blue. I, this is what I do. I help folks just like, so basically you're aligning yourself as the specialist. Okay. You, you deal, you, you, you've done this before. You have had a lot of success in helping homeowners avoid foreclosure by getting their home for sale or helping them negotiate with their bank. And so the truth is, we do have a team that we delegate to that will handle the negotiations with the lender. And if that, that does not work out, as an alternative, we will list and sell the property to make sure that foreclosure doesn't happen. So it's, it's, it's not really, uh, it's, not, it's, not brain, it's not too complicated, but there is a few things that need to be done to be able to help these folks avoid foreclosure. And all they need to know is that there is a solution and that you are there to help them. As a result, you know, if we help enough people doing this, yes, of course, we get commission, we get paid. Um, sorry, I just got a text. <laughs> Let's get back on the phone. Call has been forwarded to an automated. I figured like noon would be a good time to call because a lot of these folks, like they're trying, most, a lot of them are working. So noon and then between like six and eight o'clock is probably the best time to call there's a 1.5 million dollar property on the street is called Bentley, Bentley Court, yeah, it's a really nice area, it's right there in Petaluma, I'm gonna look at a picture of it, I mean, if your street is called Bentley, there's probably a few bucks in there. So, Red X, um, they provide different leads, but this their lead, their foreclosure leads, are probably the most thorough. So it gives you all the listing information as far as the area. Uh, it gives you the tax information, so the tax owner, the tax address, you know, the registered tax address. Uh, it gives you the foreclosure information, so it will tell you the notice of default, uh, the, the, the trustee sale date. So in this case, the trustee sale date was on uh, August of last year. So. Uh, apparently it didn't sell, they're still in the house. Um, it tells you the, the lender name. Uh, it's this, this case, it's a private lender, uh, Daniel Swanson. Uh, and so it gives you a lot of information, but when you're calling, you don't necessarily want to spend time reading all the information unless you're actually talking to them. Otherwise, you're gonna get caught up just doing too much homework and you won't be making any calls at all.
Hello, do you, hello, is calling about your property on Todd Road? Did, I was calling, I, I was calling to speak with, uh, Teles, Teles Cuevas. Uh, it's about five five nine Todd Road. Five five nine Todd Road. I'm trying to speak to the owner. Bueno. Right, are you the owner of five five nine Todd Road? Español. No. Five five nine Todd Road in Santa Rosa. Is that your property? Yeah, so you. It says this is not the number. Oh, okay. Thank you. Would you like the number? Oh, you know them? Yeah. Oh yes, please. Uh, give me a second. Okay, no problem. Yes. 81, nine. 81 what? 81, nine. 90. Thank you very much. Have a good day. Good Boom. I, I really need to learn Spanish, man. Like, seriously. I've been saying this for years, but... There's so much more I can do in sales and marketing with that second language. Hello. Yes, uh, this is Jeremy Marquez over at Coldwell Banker here in Petaluma. Hello. This is Jeremy Marquez with Coldwell Banker Real Estate in Petaluma. I was calling to speak with the owner of 559 Todd Road. Well, I was just trying to speak to the owner. I'm with Coldwell Banker, local real estate company here in Petaluma, and I was calling to see if you guys had gotten things worked out with your lender or if you were planning on selling the property. No, we're not selling it, man. Did you get things worked out with uh, the lender? Uh, who's the lender? Well, I'm calling because my department, sir, we specialize in helping homeowners who at, at one point had a notice of default. So I saw that a while back you guys had some issues with the loan. So that's why I was calling to see if there's uh, anything that we can do to help. Uh, you think, you, sir, sir, I'm working right now. Uh, I, get, I get lunch break like at one. You think I can call you back? Yes. Did, did my number pop up on your caller ID? Or? Yeah, yeah. That's my direct number. Um, if you or you can give me a text and we can talk later. Whatever time works best for you. Sounds good. Sounds good, man. Okay. Uh, your name again is Jeremy. Jeremy Marquez. Jeremy Marquez. I'll give you a call, man. And your first name? My first name is S E T. I'm the son of the owner. Uh, how do you pronounce it? Uh, Set. S E T. Set. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Just like set. Okay, set. I'm Jeremy. I'll talk talk to you soon. Sounds good, man. Okay, thank you. All right. Perfect. So listen, he was very apprehensive at first. He's like, "What do you want? Why are you calling? What are you doing?" See, listen, these type of homeowners, that's exactly how they're gonna be, because listen, they're behind on their bills. They think they're gonna lose their home. Lots of people are calling them trying to collect money, so they're very apprehensive. They don't know who's there to help them. They don't know who's there to try to get over on them. So that's why I was trying to ease into it, let them know that I'm with you know, Coldwell Banker, local real estate company. We specialize in helping homeowners who had a notice of default, see if we can help you out. And then he's like, well, uh, 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 I'm on lunch. Maybe we can talk about it in an hour, right? So that's how these are gonna work. So what I'm gonna do, is I'm gonna text them my information, 
Uh, I'm going to make sure that he, if he doesn't call me back, I give him a call back, have a conversation, listen to the situation, and see if we can help. But it sounds like he probably does need some help, otherwise he wouldn't have said, hey, let's talk in an hour. So what I'm going to do is I do need to do some admin work, and that's going to take me a little bit. Um, we have been on this live session. Eh, only 15 minutes. Eh, I'll just do the, I'll do that in a minute. I can make a few more calls. I just didn't want to... Uh, have you guys sitting too long? Give me a second here. So what we'll do is we'll save the recorded call. You know, download the MP3. Red X actually records every single call for training purposes. And then what we're gonna do here Make sure we have that downloaded. We're going to download the lead information. Basically what I do, because in my role, uh, I am the face. Basically, it's my job when I'm talking to the client on the front end to make sure that everything that we talk about is relayed to my client. So I download the recorded call, I take thorough notes, I make sure he's a, my client, he or she is aware of everything that's happening. So I wanna make sure that everything that I'm doing, they're aware of, and they make sure that everything they're doing when it relates to my deals, I'm aware of, so we're all on the same page. And so we'll download the PDF with all of the notes in there. And that way we have a little bit of time to do a little bit of research on it too. And I believe in about an hour, uh, Mark, one of the agents I'm working with, will be available. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to talk to Mark and see if I get him on the call so we can all three talk and have, actually have a real conversation, potentially have a meeting later today or tomorrow, depending on the situation. If you guys are tuned in, I know there's a few of you guys watching. Feel free to say hello in the chat. You cannot chat um, in the comment unless you are following. So if you want to chat, you got to follow. So listen, that's what's interesting about that one is, at first when I called the first, the, I talked to the the girl, then the, the the gal got on that spoke Spanish, and I was getting ready to hang up. I was gonna end the call, and then she was like, "Well, do you want their number?" <laughs> Man, if I would have hung up, you know, who knows? This may not be nothing, but if it turns into a, it turns into a deal, I'm gonna have to remember that whole story and go back to it because I was ready to hang up, and she was about to give me the number. set the call back in Red X. Um, Red X gives us the ability to set up a reminder, which will give us an email at the time we want to get a reminder, which will notify us, hey, give Joe a call, give Steve a call. session ended that's good all right it's a perfect time so since the dial session had ended I'm gonna go ahead and end this live session too no reason just to keep you guys here I'm not gonna make any more calls I gotta do a few things I'm gonna talk to Tommy talk to Mark make sure they know what's going on see if they're gonna be available for this call um, other than that guys um, I'm Jeremy Marquez J marketing we call you close also power prospecting if you're a real estate agent, um, if you 
want to learn more about cold calling, if you have a team member or an assistant that needs to get better, um, there's a link to the group. Join the group. That's for the coaching program. It's a one-on-one -on -one training program. We work together specifically on cold calling to help you guys get better. Uh, enough of the self-promo. Hope you guys have a good day. Uh, what is it? Thirsty Thursday. Go get some iced tea and relax. Have a good day.